Hello friends. So now let us discuss the second problem from the latest Code Forces Educational Round One One Six problem name update files. It is a very simple problem. You just have to draw the like one two test cases and it will become very intuitive to you. The problem goes like this: that in the Berlin State University has a new update for the operating system and initially it is installed on the first computer. So it means that it is installed on only one computer. Now update the file. should be such that it should be copied to all the n computers out there but because there is no internet facility in that university they have k cables so what you can do here is that you can take any cable connect two computers and then transfer the like the software from one to another and it will take one hour so you have to find out the minimum number of hours required to update the file in all the n computers so that's the whole problem now k n n up can be very large and uh, yeah that's the whole problem Now let us move down to drawing board, and it will become more clear to you. Let's say that I have initially it will be only one computer. Then let's say I have three cables. Cool. So what will happen here is that let us take some other. Thing. Yeah. So let us take that I have the initial computer is this. Then I have six more computers. Cool. So because I have three cables yet in the first round because the software is on one co computer i have to use the one cable only from transferring it to from one computer to the second computer cool i hope you get the point then so it will take one hour now after one hour two computers will have the software this and this so now what we'll do that we will take two wires now Okay, and then one wire will be attached from this to this, and another wire can be attached to this and this. Cool. And thus, uh, one more hour will pass, and now two computers will get more information. So now this computer has information. This has, this has, and this has. Cool. So now four computers has the uh, uh, like as you can see the information, and now there are three cables. So now as you can see now the threshold has reached. Whenever I am less than the number of cables. Then, like it will increase by one step. I'll tell you how the pattern is there. But what you can observe easily is that after the total number of computers is greater than the number of cables or greater than or equal to the number of cables I have. Let's say as you can see now four computers after two hours as the software. Now, after every hour now I have only three cables. So three computers can be transferred now, like information. Even if there are more computers, I cannot transfer them because. Even so, there is one spare computer that is left because now four computers has the information, but still I have three wires only, so I can transfer this to those three wires. So now after every consecutive hours, only three computers will be added. I hope you get the point. So I, as soon as the total number of computers which has the information is greater than or equal to the number of wires that I have, that is k, then after that it will only increase by one in each step. Cool. So let's say that I have ten computers that are left. Cool. And let's say the wire I have is three. So how many times it will take? So at every step now after like let's say I have uh, so I have let's say updated four computers. So four computers are updated. So it is greater than or equal to three the number of wires I have, and thus after that after like the number of updations that is equal to four four computers are updated. After every step only three computers will be added to the, like they will be updated with the software. So. Like after one hour, three computers, three computers, three computers. So nine computers will be added, and then one more computer. So ten divided by three, and you have to do a seal of it. So after the number of computers becomes greater than or equal to three, then after the remaining computers will be this only. Okay, so that's the whole logic. Now how can we add this? So you can just do a brute force before that. If I have one computer, then if the number of computers is less than k, k is the number of cables, then what will happen? that you will take this computer take one cable and just add one more computer then in the next step how many computers you have let's say that i have now two computers so how many computers i will add two so i can add two more computers more now it will become four and four computers greater than three then only like you can do this uh, calculation before this calculation then you have to like just take the total number of computers i have let's say that now is a number of computers i have So at every hour now will double because like it's say up two then it will become four, okay then four will become eight, okay so now plus equal to now because if I have one computer after one hour it will become two computers, 
then after one one more hour two computers will update two more computers the total number of computers i have will, will equal to four and then after four it will become eight and so on cool so that's the whole problem and the logic for this problem let's move on to the code part i mean make it more clear let us go to the code part so it's just like a simple math problem what you can see that i take the number of n and k just remember that you just take the input in log long then at the total number of computers that are updated till now so initially there's one computer that is updated and the answer is total number of hours it will take so zero then i will do a while loop till the total of computers that are updated is less than n so initially if the total number of computers that are updated is less than k as well the number of wires so what will i do i will increase my total by total itself and because like as you can see if, the, if only one computer is updated so it will become twice two computers updated and the r will increase by one so answer will be increased by one else when the total of computers updated becomes greater than or equal to the total number of wires i have then in that else condition we have to see how many more required computers i want so required is n total number of computers that that you need to be updated n minus total number of updated computer that is up till now so n minus total and then we'll just do a seal of it you can just do a seal this is just doing a seal so how we are doing a seal that if it is completely dividing by k then you just add them if it is not completely divided divide by k there is some remainder that is happening so for that you just add one to it it's just like finding out seal of uh, required divided by k cool you can also do this required plus k minus 1 divided by k that can also be done to find out the seal cool and then you can break at this point because now uh, you have taken all the computers and said that you just print out the total number of answers or the total number of hours you take and that's the whole solution as you can see that this is just a math problem like we just have to do this uh, till the total of total becomes less than equal to k less than k then we just do this while loop else we just break out of this one that's the whole logic and problem and solution and code for this problem if you still have doubt you can mention down thank you for watching this video till this point okay if you uh, like this video please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel i'll see you next time keep coding and bye